we have some really sad news today. He's, he's dead. All right, y'all. So today we're gonna do a quick water change. Both tanks are not looking so great right now. Water parameters are probably really bad and the glass in here is disgusting. So let's get to it. <laughs> That's it for the salt water right now. We're gonna add some fresh water to kind of even out the salinity. And yeah. All right, so right here we have the tank back up. It's a little foggy right now, of course, cause you know, just a water change. And we gotta do one of the most important steps, buffer. Just gonna drop a little bit in the back right here and we'll be all good. And you can see it coming that way. And then shoots right out. Alright. And for everyone who keeps telling shut up, dog. For everyone telling me that I needed to clean my glass, here you go. It's clean, kinda. It's, it's almost, you know, it's acceptable. out to eat the three amigos kind of they kind of hate each other but it's whatever no I can tell the angelfish is stressed out look at his colors this fish keeps trying to steal food from my corals not very nice buddy gotta share oh let the shrimp get it let the shrimp get it no, no, no. Get it, little shrimp. Gosh. That was a savage moment from the angelfish. The crabs got on a huge chunk of food. The angelfish came out and, like, fought them for it. There's three crabs right there that had it. Totally, like, tore it from them. You should have seen that on video. That's the most vicious I've ever seen that fish. It was hilarious. Look, pretty fish. We have some really sad news today. I woke up and I looked over at my fish tank. And I was like, why is my fish sleeping there? You know? Because Stormy likes to sleep on the overflow. And that always scares me. And I'm like, what? But then I see Stormy's okay, you know? He just likes to sleep there. And then the suction isn't as strong right here. But over here, the suction is strong. And unfortunately, I'm really sad to say 
one of the Darwins is gone. He's he's dead. I don't know how he would die, because the other one's doing fine. All the corals are fine. <sighs> but he's gone. Maybe he just fell asleep and got sucked in and couldn't get out. I don't know. That's happened to a few fish before. But I've had this fish for like almost two years. So it's just it's just really sad. Oh my gosh. Tank is powering up. The fans sound like it's about to, like an airplane is about to take off. Um, my other fish seems depressed. Oh gosh. Okay, if y'all don't want to look, like skip ahead, but there's the fish. That is so freaking sad and gross. Poor little guy. I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened to him. It doesn't look to be any injuries. The only thing I think of is maybe he just fell asleep and got sucked in. Have to fix that frag though. Oh god. That is so gross. This just always makes me really sad when something like this happens. Um, just hit my other fish tank. Um, yeah, I don't know what to say about this. It's really sad because I had this fish for almost two years and there's no sign of any stress or anything like anything wrong with the water parameters at all. So I don't know what happened. And it makes me really sad. So we have to net this guy out and give him a little fishy funeral. Alright guys, I'm about to get the fish out. This has been a great start to my day. First my fish dies. And then... We're just not going to talk about that. We're going to get the fish out. It's just a really disappointing start to my day. And now my other clownfish is going to be so lonely. So sad. I've had this fish for almost two years. Now he's gone. Poor little guy. Poor little guy. All brain saves the ocean. Fishy is all sad and lonely. I'm sad and know ya. I'm sad and know ya. Oh, we got some cyano over there. Fun time. The fish is scared of the camera, but damn, that is sad. Guess we have to go fish shopping today. Alright, guys, well, today's video was kind of a sad one. Um, how do I do that? Every time I'm here, I accidentally hit my tank. Thanks for watching, anyways. Um, Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell as well to stay up to date on all my videos. Um, next video, well, I'll just give y'all a hint. Alright, you ready? Okay. That's all I'm showing for what next video is about, so that will probably be out on Saturday. So, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see y'all in our next video.